makeup look at the moment. In the winter I prefer a little bit darker of lips, but this is my autumn makeup look at the moment. I'm really enjoying it. It's very simple, very basic. It can be done with a lot of interchangeable products, although I do tell you what I use. Um, I'm loving everything that I'm using at the moment. I think it makes my skin look really lovely and I'm enjoying it so much. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to click subscribe if you do and let's jump into it. First I'm going to start with my base which is my It Cosmetics Your Skin Red Better CC Cream in White. Uh, I really enjoy this product. It is lightweight but it is medium to fullish coverage and it just gives me a really glowy, luminous finish to my skin and I really like it. Okay, now that my base is done, I'm going to move on to my concealer. Instant Age Re Rewind Concealer in Fair for Under My Eyes and Light for any spots that I have on my skin. This is super creamy and I really enjoy the formula and I think it just gives great coverage. Okay, next I'm going to go in with my... <laughs> my NYX Blush and Taupe. This is an oldie but a goodie. In the winter time, I don't really do a lot of bronzing because I, as you guys can see, I'm quite fair and so I don't feel like it look a little bit orange if I put too much bronzer on, whereas this is a grey tone neutral and I really quite enjoy it for my contour. Moving on to my blush, I'm going to go in with my NARS blush in Dusseur. This is an old favourite. I don't think this is actually available anymore. I'm pretty sure this line got discontinued, but it's very similar to Tarte's Exposed if you want a neutrally rose colour very similar to this. And finally for the face, I'm going to go in with my highlight, which is the Benefit WhatsApp. I love this highlight. It's beautiful, it's creamy, it gives you a really nice natural glow without being too much, and it's perfect for my palish skin. To finish off with the overall effect of the face, I'm just going to spray a little bit of my Max Prep and Prime Fix Plus. I just love the way that this makes everything set into the skin and look really natural. Okay, now I'm going to move on to the eyes. So to prime slash give a good base to my eyes, I'm going to go in with Max Groundwork. This is a beautiful neutral colour. And I really think that it just gives out a, no, a nice overall neutral brown colour that's natural looking but still gives your eyes a bit of definition. Now for every day, I don't really do a lot for my eyeshadow. I will just pop in a sort of neutral coloured brown. I might go in with my Too Faced Chocolate Bar Palette and just use the colour Salted Caramel, which is this beautiful red toned brown and just sort of pop it through the crease just to give a little bit more definition but nothing crazy I'm not interested in too much today. And lastly I'm just going to go in with Champagne Truffle which is this sort of pink highlight colour in my inner corner and under the brow bone. For my brows I'm just going to brush through them today, nothing too exciting. They are looking a bit unloved but I quite like that messy unruly look. And finally I'm just going to go on with mascara to finish off today's look which is my CoverGirl Full Lash Blue Waterproof Mascara. This is my favourite mascara. It's really waterproof and it really stays on and doesn't smudge so I really enjoy that in formula. And finally to finish off today's makeup look I'm going to go in with a very neutral colour on my lips just to cover this sort of paleness. I'm going to go in with Gerard Cosmetics 1995 which is this beautiful mauve toned colour sort of like the Kylie Jenner colour that was around last year and I really enjoy it. It's like a brown tone red but I think it's really nice and neutral and just looks really great with any makeup look. And that is the finished makeup look. So this is the look that I'm wearing at the moment when I'm wearing makeup and it's not every day but it's sort of when I have somewhere to be or something to be doing that is a little bit more special than my everyday. So this is what I'm wearing every day. It's very neutral, very natural looking and it's sort of what I enjoy. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to click that little subscribe button if you guys want to see more videos from me. I am going to try and upload twice a week from now forward. And also don't forget to leave any video requests in the comments down below as well. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!